What do we know about the universe? We've landed on the moon, explored Mars, and even reached interstellar space. And yet, we know almost nothing about the universe. That's why when we see something new, it either shocks or surprises us. And today, we'll show you some really cool stuff. And probably something you've never seen before. NASA's Hubble Telescope captured two pairs of distant quasars 10,000 light-years apart that existed around 10 billion years ago. This is a very unique image because the chance of seeing a double quasar is just one in 1,000. Using data from telescopes, this visualization shows the two sets of quasars strangely blinking and pouring out light because their galaxies are in the process of merging. Now check out this awesome image. It's a supernova remnant formed 10,000 years ago by the death of a massive star, 20 times the mass of the Sun. In 2021, Hubble revisited the Veil Nebula, capturing fine details of the nebula's delicate threads and filaments of ionized gas, showing off incredible cosmic beauty. The Hubble's advanced camera for surveys captured this image of what looks like the face of a space ghost. The piercing eyes of this creepy cosmic wonder are the result of two distant galaxies in the middle of a head-on collision, the ring of young blue stars making up the eerie face. And here you can see the farthest and most primitive object in our solar system to ever be explored by a spacecraft. This is Arakoth a small Kuiper Belt object that was spotted by the New Horizons science team using the Hubble telescope. First images showed it was shaped like a snowman, but further observation showed it was flat like a pancake. What do you think when you hear the word reef? Something related to an ocean reef, right? Well, there just so happens to be one in space. This Hubble Space Telescope 30th anniversary image is titled Cosmic Reef. It's a tapestry of blazing starbirth showing two neighboring clouds of cosmic dust and gas. A little bit closer to home, the Hubble Space Telescope nabbed this image of the Cat's Paw Nebula, one of the most active star-forming regions in our Milky Way galaxy. The paw pads are bubbles of gas and dust where stars are more massive than our Sun have formed. We want to tell you it's difficult. Difficult to skip all the images because they're mind-blowing. But you're waiting for a strange object, so here's the strangest thing in our solar system. It's an odd dwarf planet named Haumea, which is about 10 times smaller than the Earth. And it has two moons. But what makes it so strange, you might be asking? Well, it's one of the fastest rotating objects in our solar system, and spins so fast that the dwarf planet gets stretched into a football shape. You may have already seen images of the iconic Pillars of Creation, but now, based on years of data collection, it's possible to go on a journey right there. This jaw-dropping visualization takes us 100 years into a giant hollow that were formed by radiation and stellar winds from the birth of massive stars. Switch the image to infrared, and the gas becomes transparent, revealing clusters of newborn stars. And this amazing image shows the star A.G. Carinae, one of the brightest stars in our galaxy, which is waging a tug of war between gravity and radiation to avoid self-destruction. The expanding shell of gas and dust surrounding the star is five light years wide and was created by eruptions about 10,000 years ago. This is a new, spectacular image showing the interaction of two doomed stars that created the ring of bright clumps of gas. Looks like a diamond necklace. Another interstellar visitor entered our solar system in 2019 after the famous Oumuamua. But you don't need to be a NASA scientist to make a small impact in astronomy. Crimean amateur astronomer and telescope maker Gennady Borisov captured the racing comet now named 2L Borisov. It came closest to us on December 28th, 2019. And astronomers said the tail of the comet was 14 times the size of the Earth. Now let's look at something really unique. Captured by the Chandra X-ray Observatory in 2020, 
The glowing purple dot in the middle of this image is a magnetar, a special class of neutron stars that possesses extremely powerful magnetic fields. And this dense star is rotating once every 1.4 seconds. This is the doomed supermassive star Eta Carinae, the hot expanding gases glowing in brilliant red, white and blue, a slow motion cosmic firework display that started 170 years ago and still continuing. This image was recently captured showing an active galaxy which is 156 million light years from Earth. The region is emitting lots of light, but dust clouds create a visual effect of rays of light that extend 36,000 light years. In 2020, Hubble was also retrained on NGC 6302 or the Butterfly Nebula. The wings of gas you see are 19,982 degrees Celsius and are tearing across space at more than 965,000 kilometers per hour. Also in 2020, the largest known spiral galaxy was discovered. Also known as Rubin's Galaxy, it's approximately 800,000 light years in diameter and has nearly 10 times as many stars as our own Milky Way galaxy. Have you ever witnessed the birth of a star? Well, the Hubble telescope captured an image of a star being born in the constellation of Cassiopeia on the corner of a nebula cloud about 7,500 light years away. And this is the spectacular full image of the nebula cloud where the star is being formed. Another image taken with Hubble in the constellation of Cassiopeia shows a new star forming nursery known as free floating evaporating gas globules, or FREGS for short. When a massive new star is born, radiation from the star ionizes the cloud's hydrogen and creates a large hot bubble of ionized gas. This is the Lagoon Nebula, and the beautiful glow at the center comes from a huge star called Herschel 36. It's so bright, it illuminates the entire nebula. The beautiful gas and dust clouds that you see are from the Monkey Head Nebula, 6,400 light years from Earth. Eventually, this material will come together under the force of gravity, forming clumps that will birth new stars. The glow comes from new stars that are bright and hot, illuminating the remaining dust in the nebula. This stunning new image is of the small Magellanic Cloud, which is a satellite of the Milky Way and orbits around the edge of our galaxy. It can even be seen by the naked eye in certain places on Earth because it's so bright. The Tarantula Nebula has been making stars for the last 25 million years, and it shows. There are actually two clusters of stars in this image that are in the process of merging together. Not all galaxies are a perfect spiral, and here's a good example. This spectacular new image from NASA of a spiral galaxy is 120 million light years away and is being pulled out of shape by gravitational interaction and intense star formation. The Hubble Space Telescope continues to wow astronomers and grabbed a face-on image of a starburst galaxy. This is M61, located in the Virgo Cluster, with its spiral arms and regions of star formation shown in red. If you've ever wondered how many galaxies are out there, this new image recently taken by NASA with the Hubble Telescope gives you some idea. This is Galaxy Cluster ACOS 295 that's 3.5 billion light years away and shows all shapes and sizes of galaxies. This is another amazing image from the Hubble Telescope showing spiral galaxy NGC 5037 in the constellation of Virgo, which is an astounding 150 million light years away from Earth. We've got some of our own star clusters in the Milky Way. This new image shows the nebula Westerlund 2, which has some of the hottest and brightest stars in our galaxy. The Bubble Nebula is a beautiful cosmic object that's seven light years across and is formed by a super hot star that's 45 times more massive than our Sun and is creating stellar winds that are traveling over 6.4 million kilometers per hour. And this NASA Hubble Space Telescope image shows what some astronomers call the Black Eye or Evil Eye Galaxy because of the dark band of dust that sweeps across one side of its bright nucleus. So, what do you think about this video? Should we do more like this? Or do our awesome viewers want to see something else? Let us know in the comments. Stay tuned to see more of our incredible universe. And thanks for watching.